Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, to Has Paws and Claws, and in today's video, I'm clearly not in my normal setting, I'm in my car, and that is because I'm taking Miss Bubbles to the vet for a checkup. Um, Miss Bubbles, I've had her for about two weeks now, I got her from the Columbus columbus humane can never say that um and we're just going to do a quick checkup i do have um a teeny tiny concern with her she kind of does re uh like restrain when she's urinating so that is definitely something that we'll be discussing with the doctor today um but i did book her an appointment um as soon as i got her um he is a very good vet so it was like kind of harder to get her in just because um i do take my other exotic pets to him and um he gets booked very fast so i'm just so glad we were able to get her in um so we are actually on our way to the vet right now and i will be adding some footage in this video um of her at the vet i don't know if i'm going to be able to record while the vet does examine her um just because i'm i don't know sometimes that can be rude <laughs> so i'm not gonna really do that but um i can definitely take um videos of her before her exam and after so let's go ahead and get right into to that footage hey guys so we are on our way to the vet right now and bubble is just you know exploring her carrier but i'll check in with you guys when we get there i have a little heidi in there for her and she keeps going in it and going from the back of it so going in from the front going out from the back um I don't think she actually minds being in the carrier, so that's pretty good. Or in the car. Oh, hi! Oh. just left um, Bubbles um, Vets Clinic and um, she is actually perfect. The doctor said that everything looks great. Um, he did not have much of a concern regarding her urinating um, because she kind of does lift her tail, I told him, but he said that um, it could just honestly be something that she normally does only because I've had her for two weeks. I don't know what is really normal for her but um he said to continue monitoring it um he said he didn't feel anything um going on with her like abdomen or anything going on like that he said it could be a urinary issue um like she could have stones or anything like that um but he said he could not feel anything and he would have been able to feel that if there was something going on um so like i said he said to just continue monitoring it i do have the oxbow urinary sport treats for her already just because i was suspecting of something like that and i was like let's just try to use this maybe we could help prevent it um but he said if there's any like different color in her urine or anything like that then to definitely book an appointment for him and we could do x-rays but he said that's um not how, he doesn't really think it should be an issue as of right now so that's definitely something we're gonna keep um looking out for she is 138 grams so she is like perfect um he said her body um score is a three out of five i believe which is like ideal so She's pretty good. She's eating, drinking. Okay, she's not lethargic oh, or anything. just made it home. <laughs> she's right behind her Heidi. Look at her. She's, oh, oh, I can never catch her. <laughs> what is it? Oh, baby. She's ready to go back home. She's like, just put me back in my closure. Oh, oh, I know. Oh, I know. Come on. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Okay, you guys, so I just made it inside, and that vet visit went so good for Miss Bubbles. Um, I do have her full report right here. I have it folded so awkwardly just because I do have my information at the top, but that office visit just uh, was so good. It finally made me feel good that nothing is going on with her that I should be super worried about, but... um with the way she's urinating uh we're just gonna have to keep an eye on that um and like the doctor said we might have to be doing x-rays so that's just definitely something i'm gonna keep like a very close eye on um but other than that we'll just go ahead and put bubbles back in her enclosure 
you guys i absolutely love this carrier though this is the first time i use it um we're just gonna go ahead and get miss bubbles out of it so she can go home i'm struggling <laughs> but it is so cute come here baby and it's like perfect for a Syrian come here mamas thank you girl oh it's okay come on let's go back home there you go there you go oh and Miss Bubbles had a very successful vet visit today Yay! <laughs> Her mouth is stuffed with treats. <laughs> All right, you guys, and that is it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching, and have a good one. You can go ahead and hit that like button and subscribe if you're not subscribed. Right, Mocha?